Taking our sweet ass time. Just trying to reach the top. We're out. There we go. This room supposedly has no secrets left in it. And as a reminder, we need to keep an eye out for this thing. I understand how to put that in. I just need to figure out where this place is. Dude, that's... We've done that and we've done this. So we need to figure out how to do these, which now I have a number. One, two, four. So I need to find three. So we're not done finding the rest of that sequence. Knowing the numbers now. Right, we're up, we're up top. That's what I'm trying to go to. Hit. Ah. This whole time there was a secret hiding behind the water level here. I, sp I lost... I spent a lot of time trying to find out how to get to any kind of secret here. And it was this the whole time. Alright. It's an owl? What? This owl does not rotate. It is a non-believer. And it must be defeated. Mr. Owl, why are you dead inside? You do have a secret waiting for me. The water trickles and pools and points in different directions as it comes out. I don't know if that's in any kind of sequence, though. Looking at stuff to see if any sort of combination can be drawn from some of these places. You've got to mean something, right? can't climb him. Does he seem to vibrate sometimes when I jump around? He does. His pixels kind of jitter. There's water pouring everywhere and there's also... That's probably audible. There seems to be a fire truck or ambulance or cop or something or all coming by. Well, not all. That'd be... Be a lot louder. Huh. Well, if the long pieces and whatnot I can't input, there's a lot of L's and long pieces here. So if I'm supposed to input that stuff, that's not good. There's a light source from above. It always looks the same no matter which way I face. Huh. I'm pretty clueless at the moment. Let's leave you for later. Maybe you'll make sense in the future. How do I leave? Ah, little ledge. I like there's no ladder around here. I might be in some trouble. Uh, it's gonna be a tower and I gotta climb up through here. I think it's actually just straight up easier for me to go back to the bottom of the lighthouse and take the warp gate at this point. Well, I'm glad I came this way for a bit, because I found some stuff. Alright, it's freaking out up there. Let's just take the warp gate for now.
We're still waiting to find you. But the other ones have been discovered. Alright, one of you is just already in the sewers, right? Eh, whatever. Let's go. Oh, gotta go around. There's a fair-ish number of things that aren't really solved yet. But now let's just see if I can find my way back to the previous spot. You were the QR code? Yeah, that's been solved. Ah, oh, I like the theme in this area. I remember it now. I like the music here. I don't like being here, though. Just because of that, it, this this mechanic makes it such a pain in the ass to get to the right room on top of the normal issues of just trying to figure out where you're going. Uh, the dumping ground area, it's that one. Is it? I think it's that one. I'm not sure. Oh wait, it's probably the, the exit? Yeah, that's where we came from. As in, like, that takes me back to the surface. That's one unsolved thing. Let's take a look at it and see if it stands out to me now. Um... What the heck? Whoa-ho! What is this? This has to be a glitch, right? Oh right, the stuff- I forgot the water murders me. What is this? Uh. I can try to rotate you. Why is it doing that? What is happening? This is so weird. What? No, you fell back under the water. You cheated. <laughs> or uncheated or something. What? Um. Oh no. How'd you get over here? Uh. Uh. Happy Glitchmas. Um. 
I made it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to reboot the game. <laughs> or something. Especially now that it teleported. Like, out of bounds. What? Oh my god, what happens if I leave and come back? Are you back to being a platform? Yes, you are. Okay. I actually get this one even though I didn't before even though I probably should have before I can catch it there we go I was trapped in the logic of like how do I make how can I catch it if I can only move the thing when I'm under it that's kind of not the point oops Ah, uh, keep mixing them up. There we go. Like that's how you rotate it. I'm not sure why I didn't solve it the first time when I came here before. I must have just been in the wrong headspace, which makes sense. Because it's a weird dimension to think in. It's hard to think about the continuity of how places are organized not making sense. Ah, that's gonna hurt. But now it's mine. Is it gonna be the fourth piece of the map? I wonder. Nope, it's a cube. A regular cube. That wasn't even supposed to be hard. That was a normal cube type of puzzle. Yeah, I don't know. I wasn't processing it or something. The first time around. It is weird. Oh, it's glitching again. They, uh, might need to look at this room a little bit. It seems to have some issues. No. Am I not gonna be able to leave? Oh, nope. I could leave just fine. I could just stand on top of it and leave. Okay, so now I need to go back to finding... The only remaining secret down here is this specific spot. That's not a door, right? No. It's back to the entrance. No other doors down here. I don't remember if you can go further down. Was there another door waiting for me down there? Yes. Leading to chest. So we've been there. Nope, oh, that's it. So it's gotta be higher. Wrong way. Making mistakes publicly. It's basically my job. So this is where I came from? No, it's the bottom right one.
I desire access. Back to the QR code. Uh, no. Ah. <laughs> ah. These rooms that have like six connecting doors, I just, I lose my mind trying to remember how to get anywhere. It might be my single least favorite part of the entire game. It's just like, I'm just like, I, the overly networked rooms where I'm just like, which fucking door is it? Damn it. There we go. Okay. It's time for us to do a little bit of arts and crafts. Turn to a new page. Uh, I'm done with that page. So many notes. Alright. So we have a T that points down. We have right. That looks equidistant, so I think the next one points up. And left. Down, right, up, left, square. Get you out of the way. No, the light. Give me light, but don't stand in front of the thing. There we go. Then it's a zigzag. Opposite zigzag. Then another square. Is that, uh, yep, that's eight symbols. So I turn my notepad sideways, and I go right, up, left, down, A, left, right, A. Ta-da! Was, was that another one over there? Oh, that's the other door. Okay. It's like, what's that? What's that? Dun-dun-dun-dun-dun-dun. Oh. Well, alright, we've gone... I mean, the sewers were the lowest point, but now we've gone to hell. So maybe this will go even lower. Hello, door. How do you do? I bet we'll get some percentages out of here. Speaking of which, how we doing? 125%. When you... It's not the longest game to begin with, but when when you also grade it out of 200, it just makes you it makes your your progress feel a little bit more satisfying because the number just goes up really rapidly while still being a number that makes sense because it's out of 200 as opposed to like World of Warcraft numbers where it's just random numbers like 15 billion damage. I'm like that's not a number that means anything to me though. Yeah. Hey, I was standing on top of it, so I got to grab it instantly. And it was a anti cube. Uh, this anti cube's getting a little antiquated. <laughs> yep. So it's like 3.1% per cube, which is a nice little meaty chunk of percentage without being like making the game super short. But it doesn't feel super short because the, the percentage isn't like some massive number. Okay. They straight up just repeat that puzzle a lot, though, which is a little odd. Like, with no variation. They just have to hear, uh, like, an eight-part sequence or something, and just try to feel it out. Alright, so I need to use this to move further, but I'm guessing this is lava, right? Yeah, that's not a good sound. He's fine. Don't worry about him. There's at least one more dork- uh... Yeah, there's one door- there's one more door here, and there's no secret here, apparently, so... It's just a matter of me getting to the top. What? It gave me a ladder? Is the lava still- Oh, the lava's still rising, it's a time limit. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Alright. I was like, why did it give me the ladder in only one turn? It's a scary... Scary surprise. I think that this stuff might burn me. It doesn't look good. I don't even want to try jumping into it.
There we go. Yeah, I think that was a barrier that was going to burn me. Oh, God. Time limit level. All right. Okay. Yep, yeah, it's not going to work. It's still coming up. Oh, boy. Uh. Oh, there we go. Uh, only one part was rotating. Gotcha. Uh. 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 <laughs> oh god, how much of this is there? No! No! Oh. Oh. No. Oh, I made it really far. I think. Where am I now? Oh, right. Back where the door let me in. Alright. There was. It, it had to be those platforming bits. But now there's a little bit of, like, jokes on you. I know the answers to a lot of it already. Although, who knows how long the segment is. You can see where to go, because you can see the ladder sticking out of the side of the wall. And a little bit of jumping makes me go faster. Uh oh. The other side's more complete, isn't it? Or it has to be the side then? Yeah. I can make that work. Getting back on up. Let's not waste any time or I'll die. Ladder, no. Uh huh. Huh. No. Hit. 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 I gotta make sure I get a running start, or I won't clear it enough. Ha. Ah. Okay. Now what? Uh. Um, you bounce off of them. Shh, what do I, what do I do? Hit. It won't, there's no, there's nothing to grab. No, no, I don't want to do it again. Oh, is this going to float? <gasps> Oh, I had to wait. It's a floaty thing. I gotta be real careful with this part. Uh. Oh no. No! Oh cool, this is a checkpoint. Like, I don't know when to- I don't know when it's safe to rotate. <laughs> you can't see the other dimensions. Okay, that that works. So left rotation. That was surprisingly brief. Uh-oh. 
Can I make that jump? I think so. But how soon before I just die? Oh, no! Oh, come on. Alright, I'm not really... I'm already tired of this. I don't really like this level anymore. It's a long wait. I'm not really doing anything. It's almost like action platforming is not really the strong suit of Fez and not really why anyone played it. There's my one input foot. I'll line myself up. And then a long time from now, I'll line myself up with the next one. I guess I'll drink coffee. Good time for a coffee break. a closer direction to be in? Not really. Oh boy. There we go. Skull head? Anti-cube. Angry, angry anti-cube. Yeah! Warp gate, which I should probably use, cause it. Bleh. Yeah, the sewers are done with. Done with now. That's all the sewers. Hundred thirty-one point two. Go ahead and cross out the combination I used a moment ago, just so I don't try to use it in the future. I don't keep my notes around unless they're like translation type notes. Uh, if it's like a combination or something, I need. I kind of want to make sure I get rid of it as fast as possible if I've solved it because I don't want to make the mistake of using it in the future. Is there a warp gate up here? There is. This continued chain leads to here. That's the sewer connection. I want to go over there to the windmill and figure that one out next. Because that's not solved. But we'll see if I can figure something else, something out about the what? Beeping. What? Hmm. It happened twice. <laughs> The weird beep happened twice, but I don't know what it was. They ha did they hide puzzles on the map? Uh, the blue stormy place is this one, right? Yeah. Where's the, win the windmill area? It's probably the green one. I think it's this one. Oh, so I guess we'll find out. When I make a mistake and then we repeat loading screens. <laughs> nope, there it is. Alright, 